Now I want to take a few minutes to show you how to use the Vokey website, which is where we are going to publish our group project or part of it anyway. Um, so I'm going to go to login and I've got myself as a student so that I can see what it looks like from your end. I've played around with it a little bit and as a teacher I can use it, but using it from a student's point of view um, is something that I want to make sure that I understand and I can, um, I can answer any questions you've got. So we're going to do this from a student's point of view. So click log in and I'm going to give everyone a password, a username and a password for this. So when you get to the Vokey site and you log in, you're going to come with, there's going to be five circles here. Um, so there's a place where you can just create, where you can present. This is where you can edit your profile. Um, this is Hangouts and Assignments. Okay, and they're all up here except for the edit your profile. So all four of them are up here as well. So if you go to create, for example, when you come over here, um, you can always get back to those five bubbles by clicking on Vokey again, and it's going to take you right back to the home page. Okay, um, this is where your assignments are located, um, and you can also edit your profile. Um, you can make, you can use the Vokey um, character to create your Vo Your, I'm sorry, you can use the Vokey character creator to make your profile. So this guy, they want me to start out as a circle. And if you see, he kind of follows my cursor wherever it goes. Um, if I decide that I really just don't want to be a squirrel, I can come over here to the characters and click on that. Um, lots of things to choose from. There's lots of animals here. Then you've got some anime and some beach scenes, that kind of stuff. Um, scroll down a little bit and there's going to be some with, so you're going to scroll up either way. Um, you can be a person. So I'll click on all characters and let's say that I would like to be this lady or I want to be Abraham Lincoln, whatever. Okay. And you can add, if you want to add a hat or hair or shirt or sunglasses, whatever, lots of things you can do here. You can change the scenery and change the colors. Um, and then to uh, make your Vokey talk, you just click on voice and it's going to give you a choice. You can either type something in or you can use the microphone. And remember when you click on the microphone recording, it may ask you a few things. They may prompt you to say, um, yes, I have permission um, to use the Chromebook microphone that you're using. Um, you can also um, phone something in or do an audio upload. But um, what I would like for you to stick with is the microphone recording. Um, and if you use the, the, te the text recording, um, you'll have to choose a voice, but let's, let's stick with microphone recording for now. Okay, so click that and then you're going to click record and I'm not sure how well this will work because I'm using Screencastify. There might be a little bit of a difference or a problem there, but we'll see. Let's find out. Let me click. Hi, this is just a test to see how the Vokey works. Then I stop and it plays it. Let's see. Okay, and then we click save. And then I guess that's going to end up being my profile. Okay. So there's my profile. So anybody that clicks on my profile, they're going to see. You can go ahead and press play. Okay. So if I want to, I can probably, let's see if it's going to let me change that. Okay, so it doesn't look like I can change it right away. I could probably figure out a way. Anyway, so um, we're going to come over to look at assignments. And the first assignment says group assignment for global, co global collaborator. This group assignment will mainly take place in Hangouts. Make sure you begin by reading all of the instructions found on CCBS. The first assignment is meant to be a place to play around and practice creating bokeys. Have fun with it. Okay, so you'll click on the edit your scene or your presentation, and it's going to bring you to another Vokey page where you can create something. And this is just for you to practice with if you want to. Okay, so I'm going to come over to Hangouts now. Click on Hangouts, and I have put myself as a member of each group. So we've got Delta Group, Gamma Group, Epsilon, Zeta, Lambda, and so on. Um, I'm going to go over to the Gamma Group, and let's see who's in here with me. If you click on this right here, there's a four and a person. Click on that. And it says the people in my group, Rachel Payne, there's my Vokey that I just created. 
Taylor Hall, Austin Bristol, and Landon Adams. So this is the group um, that's called the, the Gamma Group. Let's go back and says this hangout is where the Gamma Group will hold their animal discussion. The discussion should include a vokey for each of the following topics about your animal. Habitat, diet, anatomy, fun facts, predators, problems, and prey. And come down here, which animal did you choose? That's the first topic. Okay, no thoughts have been added yet. So I'm going to click on this and it's going to bring the topic up and it's going to have a place where you can add a thought. And I've not really played with this yet. I'm not sure how many thoughts it's going to let me add, but let's see. I'm gonna click on add a thought and it brings the Vokey creator up. And we've got this guy here. And if you don't want to be him again, you can go to, oh, let's go to all people. Let's see. Go up, up, up. You know what? I'm just going to go ahead and give it up and be Abraham Lincoln. That's okay. Okay, so now I'm going to use a voice um, or even, oh, i got a better idea. Let's say that you had an idea for an animal. Let's say that you really wanted to do, I think someone said grizzly bears a few minutes ago. or Earl Bear. Click on him, and then we're going to add a voice to him. Click on your microphone and say, I suggest that we study grizzly bears. Okay, and it's that easy. And you can click save if you want to. I'm going to X. Well, you know what? I want to hit save because I want to see if it gives me a chance to create, to add another thought. So I saved mine. Yep, add another thought. Okay, so you can add as many thoughts as you want to, it looks like. I think up here you can find tile view. Um, you can see, I think, yeah, it's just another way to, to look at um, the different thoughts that have been added here. So you can see the thoughts of everyone in your group. Um, so that's your first topic, which animal did you choose? I hope this helps.